once it's lit up, it's fired up the inverter. Okay. You can read what's going on on here. We've got this one, that's not the one we go. That I've got that one. On this one. No, I've got that one. Mm. Excuse me. Pit stop, we're at Greg's. Um, coffees and sausage rolls. You know what Jules has done with the sausage rolls? Oh, oh, in my bag. In the bag. Mm. What have you got there, though, Jules? I've got a bacon baguette. Ooh, look at that. So that'll be tasty. We're going to eat these now and then we'll carry on. Just let me say, if you're going traveling and you want a breakfast, Greg's is a, is a must. Yeah. Please, Greg's, give us a sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> One happy lady, look. <laughs> With the bacon sandwich. And I'm happy to. Another bacon sandwich. You can't beat a bacon sandwich in Greg's. Enjoy. So there's plenty of traffic getting up to uh, Scamston Hall. Uh, we've had quite a few delays. We were set off at 7 o'clock this morning, just before 7 this morning. It's now, what time is it now? Really 12. Um, it says on the sat nav just couple of miles away now so we'll uh, pick you up when we're actually going down because it's very very slow moving traffic so if they say things go by it's probably going to be really busy but we will see so it looks like it's going to be a busy so. one here so yeah what we're saying so yeah Everybody looks like it's going to be a busy one so, so. Our location we're in the forest. Look at this beautiful. The weather's absolutely fantastic. So, this is where we parked just on the field here. Beautiful, though. Lovely. Look at it. And the event's just over there by the looks of it. So you can just go walks just over there. That's the event. Couple of VWs there, look beautiful. I think this could be a good festival. I've got that feeling. He's completely we've got a uh, divorce in a bag. <laughs> Me and Julie know all about them. That's why we've got the air one. Hello, Max. Hello, Max. Are you happy? Are you happy? I like it. Nice, isn't it? She likes to. So with that, we'll uh, we can have a drink of some kind or other, and then we'll be back with you. We're going in the forest, mate. Yeah. I'm in Craig. We're going in the forest for Nuki later. No, we're not. Hey. No. Not Nuki. Stop. It. <laughs> <laughs> Max can go running through the grass, Luke. Oh, okay. Whoa. Oh, this is the life, and it? it's Friday afternoon, just gone midday, long drive. But now we're relaxing. Nice bottle of red there, couple of glasses, hats, nice neighbours. Beautiful. 
Lovely and sunny. What a complete change from last week. Beautiful. So here's my Doris, Luke. Sitting down, chilling out with a glass of wine. Just gone midday. We're out for some, innit? Living yeah. the dream. Like I said in the last video, follow your dream. Let's zoom in on you, see. Let's have a bit closer. Oh, no, it's gone out. That's in. Ooh, in, out, in, out. Shake it all about. Max is living his best life. Max is always living his best life, aren't you, mate? <laughs> so, we're heading out for a walk now. As you can see, it's packed here already. It's a very relaxed festival. When we came on, that, that field there in front was empty. Yeah, well, this was empty when we came. Oh, shit, gone down a hole. <laughs> Trust me, yeah. Straight down the hole. Rabbit hole. Yeah, so this is, obviously that's where we're parked. We've got a nice space between us. But it's just like, I don't know, got it. Just park where you want. It's not really. I think you're supposed to have space between each of you, like. But I think leaving people to be sensible enough to themselves and know what they want. Cut them. Just loads and loads and loads of people here. This should be a cracking festival here. So as you can see, we've only just uh, set off really from where we're parked. And we're already, well, we're already in the festival, really. Look at it. This is what you call a festival. Try and zoom in a bit for you. Look at that. Sorry if that's a bit fast. Try my best to be slow. You like the ones on? Look at these. Nice. About that I'd fit in between ours. What's that, darling? Oh, it's too wide, you know. It's just too wide. Can I have a biscuit? Go, <laughs> help yourself. So we've got no power, no problem, solar powered generator. God, that's just water gas. It's on you. Any item of five, just look at one of them. If um, Gareth hadn't got one, I would have got him one of them. Gareth? Yeah, from Pews. Has he got one? Yeah, he got a black one didn't you, instead. It takes a wee while to get through them all, and just a bit of steampunk stuff here, look. Going into your steampunk gear. Cracking bit of stuff here. Cracking bit of stuff. Quidditch. If you're Harry Potter. Pulling sinks. Smart, come on. Oh, how cool is that? Good, yeah? yeah. Wow. Smart, haven't you? Can you do a 2020 uh, Ducato yet or not? Um, I can I can try. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, we actually, yeah, so I've um, spoke to the guy just about getting a second key cut for Envis with a remote fob. Uh, I think it's about 150 pounds, but he's not sure if the remote will work or not yet. Which is a bit of a shame, but um, I don't know whether just go go for it and have a punt on it. He says because he'll charge me just the normal price for a non-remote key if it doesn't work. But I could be the guinea pig and see how we go with it. Not bad for a five. Look, if we go. Oh, look at that. Nice. One of these fluffy hats. Do you want a fluffy hat? No. I bet that would be good for you, Luke. On a dark highway, cool wind in my hair. A bit cooler as well. Doggy, doggy. About one of these. You must want one of these. 
a trike, look at it. No, oh, that, look at that, you can do your shopping on it and everything. You get rid of the ranger then, you can use that for your shopping. It's a babby, isn't it? Five point nine meters. Yeah, you can zoom into that. Have a look at that. Save eleven thousand off stock price. Is it open? No. There's one here for sixty nine. I think a lot of the reasons it's, it's on a VW. The VW chassis, so it's obviously pushing the price up slightly. They're only small, aren't they? Wow. Wow. Two on this one. Look, that's smart, yeah. Nice. Shower. Kochuk. Nice little wardrobe. It's a little blind there. Look at blind there. Wow. Look at that, there. It's a shower tray. Oh, cause it's got a pop top. Oh, fun to go. That's a shower tray. Oh, look, the shower tray's in the room. How handy is that? In a small compact van, you've got a shower, toilet, you pop drop. Can I help you? Eh? It's yours, look. This is Julie's van. It's a Westfalia Jules. It's not 70 grand, it's not. Anybody fancy a climb? That was a song, wasn't it, by Miley Cyrus? Anybody fancy a climb? No, the climb. Oh, the climb. It's good shooting, shooting range. Pew, pew, pew. Ooh, should we go there? Watch music. Like. Nice the van lifestyle. I did see that that was on. There's some books to have your nails done. You've seen state my nails though. Look, they've even got a nail bus stock hole there. Get your roof off. Get your roof off. off. Get your roof off. Dolly Daydream. Daydream. It's a daydream. Okay. <laughs> what? I thought it was a dolly daydream. It's a daydream. You know what it is? Right. Right, so this is the solar... Green tech generator. Green tech generator. Two manuals with it. Yeah. You've got a quick start. Dead easy. Okay. Follow the instructions. Get the best out of it. Okay. That tells you all the functions. This one, 38 pages. People never read them, but I recommend you do. Okay. It tells you the best, the best performance. Okay. Right, to turn it on, press and hold that button okay. until it lights up. If you just dab it, it won't come on. Okay. Once it's lit up, it's fired up the inverter. Okay. You can read what's going on on here. That's your 240 volt side. Yeah. yeah it's gone up to 240 volts. Like I said earlier, if you get a fault, it'll trip out. You'll lose everything. Can't get it back online until you've until you've reset it. Back it on. Yeah. Battery gauge. So this is ninety-two percent. When you plug a kettle in, an 800 watt kettle, that'll go down. Okay. Don't panic, it hasn't gone flat, it's just telling you what's going on. Yeah. It's a very active live, it's not like your mobile phone. Yeah. As soon as you turn the kettle off, it'll recover back to probably 0.1 volt less than where you started. Okay. And then by the time you drank that coffee, it'll have gone back up again. If you're using your 12 volts, you're permanently live, okay. in and out. Your AC charger you get with it yeah. goes into there. Okay. Your solar panels go into here. Okay. That green light doesn't tell you it's charging, it tells you your panel's connected. Oh, right, okay. Okay. Again, 240 volts, turn it on. If you don't want 240 volts and you're just using your 12, turn that off, save your battery. Yeah. Your, your separate switch on there for your USB standard and your USB-C, which oh, is right, the yeah. one that everybody's moving to. Yeah. Uh, and just turn it off again when you're not using it. Again, saves the battery. Okay. That's it really, you've got, to, you've got to be careful of, the only thing I see, it is waterproof and you can jet wash it down, I'm very happy for you to do so, just make sure that cable's through the cable gate, Yeah. that's critical to it being waterproof, 
If it's there, yeah. it'll become nipped. Yeah. But you might still get the lid shut. When you're plugging your solar panels in, just put a loop on the cable and put it come out of this one. Yeah. And if you can come out of that one, or if you come out of that one, just loop it round so it yeah. there so you're not bending it tight. Good morning everybody, it's the second day of the festival. First day for the general public to come in. So we're just sitting here, you can see Max at my side. It's a bit grey and overcast there, you see some blue sky in the distance though. Um, spent some time last night with Stephen Cat from Fieldview Adventures. Thanks to the company guys, it was uh, good catching up. Julie's just over here chilling out, seeing what we can do for the rest of the day. Shop, 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 till you drop, drop, drop. No more shopping, spent enough money yesterday. We've got some nice neighbours there as well, look. They're very pleasant. I think they've just subscribed to us as well, which is thanks. So, thanks guys for subscribing. It means a lot to us. looking at is a niche to get into um, to go self-employed now I used to do camping as a, uh, a professional entity I used to get paid for it I've always enjoyed it um, uh, but I was looking at EV charges solar and I was looking at doing all these aspects of work um, nothing really materialized for it and then I don't know if anybody's heard of a platform called next door Okay, somebody had put down my T5 camper van, all the electrics are going away, um, nothing's working and I'm going away tonight. So me being me jumped on and said, I'll come and have a look for you. So I went round there, got it all up and running for him, didn't expect to hear back off him. On Monday he said, right, can you rip it out and put a new system in? I was like, bingo, I think I found the niche that I was looking for here. So I was sat down in the uh, the canteen with a friend of mine and he turned around and he was like, have you even thought of a company name? And I was like, well, no, I do electrical and mechanical, so Electrimech. It sort of rhymes, it sort of fluid and everything like that. Not necessarily aimed at camper vans was the name, but lo and behold, from that day forward, Electrimech was born. In 2022, I opened up the doors and I did all my research on what you guys want in your vans. So when I was told that you wanted inverters at 3 kilowatt at 12 volts in van, I was like that. Why? That's a massive amount of battery power, okay, that you need to boost it back up, so it back up its side to get it up to 240. But lo and behold, everybody wants them in the vans because apparently they want emergency 240 in the vans. Don't still don't understand it to, to the day. So that, that's a little bit of an insight about myself. Okay. So we just had a cracking talk to um, Electro Tech, I think they're called. If they're not, they'll, we'll redo this bit after. But yeah, it was uh, very interesting on about 12 volt and 240 volt systems in your vans and safety. Um, I'll put a bit about it on here if you uh, want to watch and go over to um, his Facebook group and see what they're all about. He does workshops and things to teach you how to do electrics properly to stay safe so yeah get over there uh, Star Wars going on here look <laughs> look at these <laughs> that's a likely bunch 
Aye. Look at this likely bunch. <laughs> you want to look on the other one, yeah? <laughs> Have a look. Yeah. Good job. Good side, mate. He's getting dropped, that's good, too. Yeah, yeah, cool, isn't it? And do you? We've got this one, that's not the one we've got. I've got that one. And this one. No, I've got that one. Yeah. I've got that one. Really? You went. Don't use that one, do we? Hello? I know we should. Well, if you have a look, we'll let you see what you need and I'll get the paces for your place. Okay. Sorry. Two seconds. Guys, okay? What's that? Max. Yeah, good you. Is that one that you can buy? It's got bundles on this time, look. Sorry, what? We've got bundles on this time. Super 7 one, what would it be? what we bought all the separate, yeah? There we go. I've been saying to you I want something for the shoes. Yeah, you said it before, you said a few times actually. Yeah. Want to shoe thing? I said it because we free up more space in the back. Yeah. I meant to think it's going to be the zips off. Yeah, it's good, yeah. Just zip everything in. So good to see Electro Mech after you whenever he's in. He's not there at the minute, so wait till he's there. Excuse me. There's you in it. Restrictions. Who is in the UK? Oh, the UK is a nightmare. We are, we are having a nightmare in the UK at the moment. If you if you live in a van and you're looking for parking places, it is really, really hard. But uh, good old UK have it in their wisdom to just clamp anything down that's for free. Because they don't like you getting anything for free. We all know that. Uh, but in Europe, it's a lot, it's a, big, it's a bigger, bigger, massive difference, isn't it's it? It's a breeze as soon as you leave that ferry or tunnel um, in France. You know, you've got the, the motorway services and a lot of people, you, you might say, well, don't, parking the motorway services but the facilities are still good but don't stay overnight because it's quite a turnover of crime because it's a quick getaway but there's plenty of little villages and towns right through France simply with little airs and park ups with water and what toilet waste and stuff for a start you don't even need to go very far do you before no, you get there. France is amazing for airs it's absolutely one after another and they're all marked out on the motorway for you um, but like I say you go to Europe it's a com completely different ball game I hope that's come across on the vlogs as well that we've explained that Europe well we're just leaving um, the Van Fest. Um, we've had a great weekend. Um, it's another one. Another one on. Which is the darling? It's another one to put on the list before we get to do again. It was an excellent, excellent atmosphere. The last um, group of the night, the group of the night was Abba and they they smashed it. Really, didn't yeah, they? Really good job. channels and so